going on, y'all? I'm here at the uh, cutter today. I'm going to be trying to do some fishing down here between the uh, boat and the dock. I'll let y'all know how it goes. Got two dozen live shrimp. And for my setup, we got a Daiwa BG 4000, a Shimano. What reel is this? Sedona. It's a 3000 size reel. And I got my old trusty Cronart for uh, just to back up. Got some ice in the cooler. Shrimp. Hopefully I can keep them alive. I'll put some ice in there. See how it goes. We're just gonna give it a shot with the, the rig I got on there now. Grab a shrimp. Oh yeah, this water's nice and cold. We'll try to hook them through the horn first. See. Hopefully my hook's not too big to kill him. We'll see. Down a little deeper than where the pinfish are at. Oh, I had one. Oh, I got one. There we go. This might be a snapper. Oh, I accidentally stopped recording. Yep, that's a good mangrove. Nice. I don't remember what they have to measure here to keep. He might be a 12 incher. Get a good shot of him. I <laughs> got it on the chest mount, so just have to squat down there. Yeah, we'll get a, uh, a ruler on him. Let look up the size. It's always good to check out to keep a few of these things. Anything past that, I'll just uh, throw back or we'll see. I'm just letting it sink a little ways and drifting it. I'm trying to get down past those uh those spotted pinfish. They're pretty vicious. Something's beating it up. I don't remember how far I let it sink last time. Really, you can just walk it around this pier. There's something on there. There we go. That's another snapper. I'm gonna create a highlight like that. There we go. Man, he is not wanting to come up, is he? Oh, this is a baby red snapper. I'll have to throw this one back. Huh. I'll take y'all up so y'all can see him. Probably a little 12 inch or something. Little dude. See you later. Get us another shrimp. Bring her back this direction. I think they're biting it when I get right on those pilings. Something else I like to do is let it sink down and then just bring it up off the bottom real slow. And look, there's a fish. Got him. That's a good one. Look at the little fish down there. Let's see what it's gonna be. He's shaking a lot, it's gotta be a snapper. It's another baby red. I'll throw him back again. And there he'll go. Little red snapper, probably a 12 inch or so. Hook him right through the nose. He won't be hurting her at all. Hold on buddy, I'll let you go. Let's see if I can shake him off. There we go. All right, another shrimp. That's four shrimp down. They've been walking around this baby. Her fender. I don't know if this audio is gonna be any good with all the background noise we got here. I got something on there. Oh, that's a good fish. Oh yeah, this is a fighter right here. This could be a really good one. <laughs> Tighten the drag down a little bit, this bad boy. He's heavy. Might be a drum. Oh. oh my gosh. This is probably just a big old red snapper that I'm not gonna be able to keep. Oh shit. 
I done got no more in line on my fishing rod. He wants to get me tangled up down there, but he ain't gonna. I got 50 pound braid on here, so I should be able to pull out just about most, most of those medium sized fish. Here he comes. Yep, that's a keeper red snapper all day. Oh, that sucks. We'll go put him on measuring tape just to see. Oh man, that'd be a good eater. It's hard not to put this one in the cooler. Out of season by one day. Let's see. Yep, that's a keeper. 16. There we go. No, that was too small. Little though. That's what I'm after. Let's see if I can get him. See you later. I did. I drove it up. I did drive it up here. I just dropped my stuff off and parked it. I did. Right here. Yeah, I did. No, you have it over there. I'm gonna come back and pick my stuff up. I just didn't want to leave it parked here. <laughs> no, I'm serious. I drove it out here, dropped the stuff off, and then I drove back to the parking lot.
That's a snapper. Yep. Come on up, boy. That's a good one. Yew. Here you go in a bucket. All right, let's see. He's gonna be 10 at least. Yep, 12. He was right underneath that uh, fender over there. Look at that. Look at that. Come on, look at that. There we go. Another mangrove. Let him swim around for a minute, see if he'll lure up another one. A lot of times if they sit there bugging out, a bunch of them will come out from underneath that dock. He's a little too small. I'll get him on the camera, though. Did I add a highlight? Pretty little fish. Oh, damn. K.O. It's gotta be a red. <sighs> yep. Shoo, he's a mad dog. Red snapper. Oh, something's firing me up, something small. Yep. Take it if you want it. Oh, I got him. I'll be freaking down. What the hell is that? Pinfish. Fuck you, pinfish. You want to see the ugly bastard right in front of our rusty anchor? Look at you, dude. You're wild. Gee. Oh my gosh. I got something big. Oh my gosh. What is this? Oh my God. This is gonna be a long fight. Holy cow. That is a heavy fish. It's gotta be a drum. Gotta be. We're gonna have to start making our way back toward the drop net. <laughs> He's trying to stick to the bottom too. Look at that rod bending. Oh my gosh, this is a big fish, y'all. If he's pulling this hard on this rod, it's gotta be a black drum. Look how slow he's going, but that is heavy. That is heavy. Osborne! I need help! <laughs> Get that net! I got a big fish on. It's gonna be a minute before I get him to the top. But I ain't gonna be able to land him alone. Look at my rod. Look at my rod. It's gonna be a big black drum or a red drum. I can tell by how slow he's swimming away. I don't know how you use this. Uh, so turn her, turn her like you got it. And then this rope right here, you'll just lower it down to the water. And this is your handle. Why is it, what is it caught on? Nothing. Look, 
Uh, this is how it's supposed to be like this? Yeah. Okay. I think. It looks like it's caught. Oh yeah. Just unhook it from there. There you go. And then that should swivel. It's a little tangled, but it'll work like that. And then this will be your rope you lower down. This fish is going to take a while to tire out. It's heavy. I could tell. This is going to be a 20 pound fish or so. I think, I don't think I got my scale in the car though. We'll have to get measurements. I got my measuring tape. Use the scale that <laughs> it's a drum for sure. Or a giant stingray. It ain't shaking its head enough to be a, a snapper. I already added my highlight for this. Oh my gosh. Look at my rod. Oh. It's a good thing I got an 80 pound leader on here. Yeah, so you'll just lower it down to the water when I get the fish. I'll bring him into the net and you can just pull it straight up. We'll be able to see him here soon, I think. He's still a good ways down there. I'm going to take some drag away from him. See how easy he's pulling it? I just tighten it down five clicks. I'll walk with him so he can't get me up underneath there. Come on out, boy. Oh, my God. Yeah. He does not want to turn around. Oh, he's rubbing on barnacles. That's not good. I might have just got sharked or something. It just got lighter. Nope, he was just up underneath there. Oh my gosh. Come on up. He is not done yet. There he goes. I got a good pull on him. Oh, I see him. He's on the edge of these barnacles, though. It looks like a red drum from what I saw. Oh, my God. What is that? Oh, my God. It's the biggest red drum ever, dude. Dude, this is going to be... This is going to be my biggest fish. Holy cow. Dude. It might be a black drum, but it's still huge. I'm going to get him around these ladders. He looks red down there. Dude, if this is a red drum, this is a mega. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> oh, the freaking little shrimp, bro. Yeah, he's belly up. He's ready to go. Dude, is that a red drum? This is like a fucking state record. Oh my god, if this is a red drum. Yeah, you can lower it. Is that thing red? No, it's a black drum. I can tell by the shape. Yep, just lower it down to the water. There you go. Just keep lowering it some. That's good. I'll be able to bring it right to it. He's barely in the lip. Pull, pull it up. Pull it up. I can't. All right. He'll pull. get in there. There we go. All right. My line's slack. Oh my God. <laughs> you need help? <laughs> Dude, he is brown for a black drum. Oh, man. Ain't that a hell of a fish? That ain't the biggest one I've ever seen, but that's a monster. There we go. I'm all something. Bobby McGee got me one. Just me and old Bobby McGee. The big old shrimpy. Pulling up a fish. Whoa, that's a fish I can take home. Daggum. I thought it was gonna be another friggin' snapper. It's a big old flounder boy. Yeah. Yeah. That's gonna go in the oven tonight. All it took was all it took was the mega shrimp to get me a big old flounder. <laughs>